What is fearless? Do you remember when you were young and there were a few things that really scared you? Except for darkness or your parents calling you using your middle name. The whole neighborhood knew what that meant. Yes, there was a time when running through the house, jumping on the beds, or hanging out in the tree out back was fun. There was time when it was fun to have fun and not worry about what might happen. An example is when you learned to walk. You might have feared falling down, but you were focused on achieving. There was no way you were going to let balance get in the way of additional freedom and accepting the wonderful praise that was lovingly given to you. Fearless is the ability to move forward without letting your inner self stop you. It is not about being reckless. Fear causes us to pause, reevaluate, and hide from some imaginary issues. Fearless is defined as the lack of fear. And many studies show that fear is learned. It is easy to avoid fearful situations. We can block it out, which then causes greater stress, anxiety, and we can miss a great opportunity. We learn fear from many different situations, and we store these feelings in our mind, which is recalled at a later time. Fear affects everyone. It stops us in our tracks too often. Even successful salespeople fear picking up the phone and making a call without worrying about rejection. Business owners may fear addressing employee issues because of stressful confrontation. People seeking a new opportunity, such as a job promotion or a new employer, often become fearful of a new environment. Dare to be fearless helps you overcome feelings of fear and move forward confidently. It is not about being reckless. Fearless people evaluate the situation, understand the issues clearly, and develop strategies to overcome fear and minimize the risk. Let's return to the example mentioned before, when children learn to walk. This brings a smile to our face, doesn't it? This task was accomplished with a great deal of encouragement. Someone showered the child with praise, coaching, and support. Because of this positive reinforcement, the goal was accomplished. Fear of letting go was overcome by support, encouragement, and excitement. It's amazing how we forget the basics of overcoming fear as we grow older and let our minds play tricks on us to the point of stopping us from achieving what we want. In fact, wanting something is the first step in overcoming fear. This is where Dare to be Fearless comes in. We help you overcome the mindset of fear that might be stopping you from achieving what you want. It is not about what you need. There is a difference. If you have a need, you fill it. Needs are short term, such as I need a drink of water or I need something to eat. And once these needs are filled, you return to the usual mindset, satisfied for now. Your wants are much broader and longer term. We address our needs and struggle with what we want because wants are a larger concept where a need is very specific. Let me share a true story that might help outline the difference between needs and wants. A ninth grader publicly stated that he wanted to play college football. His peers laughed and gave him some grief, but it did not deter him. He had many fears about stating this to his friends, but it was something he wanted. To achieve this, he needed to be stronger, faster, and impress college coaches. He got stronger and faster but did not impress the coaches to the level expected. He continued to address the needs required to be successful and walked on with no scholarship to a national caliber football program. He graduated in four years, earning four varsity letters with all conference recognition. 
He didn't let his fears control what he wanted. He listened, learned, and with guidance, he did what he needed to do to accomplish what he wanted to do with support from his teammates and coaches. The Dare to be Fearless professionals, often referred to as coaches or mentors, will work with you to reach a new level. It is focused on what you want and you will be guided on the journey to achieve it. Your wants cannot be given to you. This is really up to you. You will receive guidance to overcome your fears from experienced business professionals who will help you shine a light through the darkness to achieve what you want. You can take your career, your business, and your confidence to a new level, which will allow you to flourish. Multiple studies show a large return on investment of seven times and some up to 49 times the amount invested. Very few investments have as much impact as business coaching on your life, your career, and your business. Therapists focus on the past. We focus on what your future can become. Everyone has a past, but it's the future, what you want out of life that holds promise. Because your coach has walked in your shoes and down the same path, they know where the pitfalls are and have the benefit of knowing the roadblocks that could hinder you. Your school of hard knocks has already been defeated and the road is smooth, but still very challenging. You are not alone. Your Dare to be Fearless coach will provide guidance, support, and help on your journey to what you want. Here are a few opportunities to consider. What would a new job or a promotion mean to you? How would your business operate if key issues were dealt with confidently and effectively? Could you become the sales leader and double your income? Discover your future opportunity by becoming fearless in life and business and for your future. If you have something that you want but are struggling to achieve it, we ask that you take the first step and write down what you want. We understand how fearful this can be and we are here to help you. Contact us and you will receive a free, no obligation session by taking the simple step of emailing us at iwill at daretobefearless.com. The no obligation free session will assess where you are so you can take your life, career, or business to new heights. Now it is your turn. Go to daretobefearless.com today to contact us. Ask yourself, what do you have to lose?